How's it going, everybody? Inskip Gaming here. This is episode three and the final one for this Drift E36. Um, if you haven't seen the last two, I'll leave um, leave them right here. Uh, but yeah, so last one we buttoned up the suspension and the interior as well as the brakes. Uh, now we just need a motor and radiator and fluids and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I'm digging the way it came out. Uh, I still haven't done a livery. I haven't found one. Uh, I'm actually recording these back to back to back. So I will find one tomorrow. And then when I record my next video, which will probably be working on this, um, we'll throw the livery on it then. Uh, but this is... Well, I don't even know what motor this was. I wanted one I could paint match. 318. So, nothing crazy. Um, I'm not going to go, like, forged or anything. I just want something with a little bit of pep. So, maybe, like, a horsepower crank or... Honestly, we could just do a stock bottom end. Let's just do that. We'll do a stock bottom end. It'd probably be a lot better. Um, and we'll build the heads and... Or put built heads on it and that kind of stuff. Okay. Um... Two head gaskets. Um, need that. Okay, we'll do a performance. So that's a performance carb. I don't know if that one's better than like these carbs down here. Uh, let's see, where do they go? Right here. 800 CFMs. So we'll, we'll throw that on there. Alright, what, what do we have so far? A bunch of stuff. Need the crank. We'll mess with the bottom in here in a minute. Let's go ahead and so we have everything. Uh, did I buy head gaskets? I thought I did. Yep, right there. Head gasket and a head gasket. All right, and this is the right side. And the left. Left. Oh my god. That's good for a cylinder head, you know, just drop it. Okay. We still gotta buy rockers too. Probably do like some one. I don't know, I'm probably gonna put a beefy beefy cam in it. So I don't know if it really matters, but we'll throw one sevens in it. And then my favorite intake in the game. Love the look of it, uh, and the reason I didn't go with a five six, which is you know your standard block, because it's orange. Um, I mean, yeah, I think there is actually one that you you can uh, you can paint, but I wasn't that worried about it. Oh, you can't do... Oh, yeah, you can. Okay. Yeah, I don't know how this carburetor does compared to the performance carb. Um, so, this is what we'll be running. What am I? This thing's a lot taller. Mm, damn, we may have to readdress this. Thing may be uh, too tall. All right, let's get some some one seven rockers and for a cam. Oh, I just seen it. Where to go? Street. Yeah, let's go street cam with one sevens. 
All right, now we can get this buttoned up. And this one. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I always so every time I build a motor, it seems like I build it fully build it. I'm trying to get away from that, you know, just throw like kind of like a budget build, you know, decent cam, some good rockers, set of heads, that kind of stuff. All right. Uh, da, da, da. We're not going to throw a blower on it. I think it's a little overkill. Paintable water pump. Paintable steel pump. Timing cover. Some wires. Alright. Um, let's see what colors we have in here. That's black. Use that for sure. Um, paint the dual pan black. And the front cover. I don't think I'm going to run that uh, fuel pump either. We gotta put pistons in it first, jack wagon. That needs to be yellow. Clear. There we go. Uh, pistons, all right. Let's see. Plug wires HP. Just trash them. You don't need them. All right, distributor. Pull that off in there. There's my wrench. I like that red. Um. Okay. Pistons. So, this is the save file with the messed up uh, barns. Like, if I go to load that, everything goes to hell in a handbasket. So, with that being said, I don't know, because eventually, I might have to get rid of some cars, because my frames. Uh, so, yeah. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Maybe just... Just sell them, you know. Maybe just take a couple to the dealer or to the service center and see what they'll give me for them. Something like that. It'd be a pretty cool episode. Just go, you know, total them out and bring them back and be like, hey, what did you give me for these? Alright, don't pull the Wii Play. Put your oil filter on. Okay. Um, what do we need? What do we need? We need a cam, shaft sprocket, alternator, for the belt. And some headers. And a paintable harmonic balancer. I'm in pain. Harmonic balancer and thermostat housing. All right. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. So much stuff. Um, 
harmonic balancer and thermostat. All right, so that should be everything for this motor in a nutshell. Okay, so this needs, this and this needs painted. Um, paint that and then this go there because that's going on a actually no there we go so now we should have enough to button this bad boy up Alright, uh, let's do the front cover stuff first. We need to get all this shit out of my way. Alright, so we'll need this. Frank. Cam. Alright. And then this. Cover, which is four bolts. Fire monitor pouncer. Okay. Fuel pump. Cool. Yeah, I'm not putting a big fan like I always do either. I'm trying to change it up a little bit, guys. Creature of habit, I know it. Okay. And that. What else we got? We got spark plugs and exhaust. Hopefully this will fit like this breather setup. I guess we shall see. All right. Um, we need this. One. Two. Three and four. Uh, I'm doing pretty good on time too. But yeah, I want to personally thank all of y'all for the way my channel has been growing here lately. Um, it means a lot. Um, I got really discouraged last year. It seemed like everything I did didn't matter, so took some time off, came back, and uh, Y'all are killing it. So I want to thank y'all for that. Got this thing tightened down. Alright. Um, 
Right. Okay. So for exhaust, I have no idea what we're going to be able to run in this. All right, glitch out in three, two, one. Yep. Every time. Put a motor in a car. Oh, dude. And if it's like a glove. All right, so now we just need to button this bad boy up. Get some exhaust on it. Get some oil, radiator. So, go all engines, E36, and then we'll go two engines and see if it's got a specific radiator. Nope, it's a gas tank. All right, exhaust pipe. And I'm thinking we're going to go with a big old fart can. Right? Dragging the ground, isn't it? My Atlanta, how in the hell are you supposed to? We had to raise that bad boy up a little bit. Oh, yeah, that big old tip on it. So we're going to have to raise that thing up a little bit, I think. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Raise it up four all the way around it. Yeah, it's still low, but not too low, you know. Where the hell does this thing go at? Motors in. Radiator. That's what we were doing. So I'm assuming it's just going to be the wolf then. The wolf radiator. There he is. Lower and upper. See, this is the upper. car don't have a whole lot of room for nothing unless you're putting the radiator hoses on it. All that room for activities. Okay. Um, get two of those, two of these, and then let's run over here and get some brake fluid. S's and G's, you know. All right, cool. Uh, let's take this cap off. There we go. All right, well, I'm not going to bore you with all putting all the fluids in it, so I'll pick y'all up here in just a second. All right, well, that's that. I did have to go back and get some more oil because one of those that I had that showed full was empty for whatever reason. Radiator's full. Brakes are full. So let's put some fuel in this bad boy. Potentially. There, 
Okay. I don't know how much of that went in there. Okay, so I do know we only have one exhaust on it. So that's what we play with saying. So we're going to have to... Let's go all cars. V8. We're going to have to... Get the dump. Or, let's see. That would be the right, correct? Yes. And then he said he painted his black, so you didn't see it. So, which is a grand idea. Color. Because it'll, it like, goes through the floor. You can see it through the floor. Yep. Okay. Okay, so it shouldn't be as loud now. Um, I guess moment of truth. Oh, nope. Remember what I told y'all? You gotta save the game and quit. All right. Well, I had to take the tent off that windshield because couldn't see deadly out of it. But this is a all familiar sight if you've watched any of my Mon Bazoo episodes. Oh, well, you know what might help? We had some wires and a battery and a... <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, well, kind of jumped the gun on that one, but... Let's see. Is there a battery box? I don't think so. Let's just go battery... Uh, so battery and got to need a fuel line. Might need that. And you know wires. So I got a little excited. Happens to the best of us. Uh, okay. A headlight fall out? Oh, okay. Apparently I forgot to screw those down too. Mother of God. You can't see shit. All right, I know you're around here somewhere, buddy. You're right there. There it is. All right. Um, fuel line. Okay. Battery. Done. Headlights. Lots in it. Lots are in it. All right. Okay. Battery. Will you fire? Yes, you will. All right, let's go put some gas in it. But you know what you can't do? You can't go anywhere unless you have pedals. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was excited about this one. Don't don't mind me, you know. I was like, why is this thing not revving up? Need a little checklist next time I build a car. All right, now I think we got everything. Right? Thing, but runs out. Then we'll save it. We'll drift it. Try to wreck it. You know, all the fun stuff. Hey, hey. I'm moving. Okay. There we go. Fill this bad boy up. But yeah, the livery will be next. Um, like I said, that'll just be a separate. That'll, I'll just throw that in on another episode. Um, let's try to figure it out. I don't know what I'm going to put on it. Um, we plays looked freaking sick. So, um, honestly. I don't know. Alright, did I? What the hell? You can let air out of your tires? I did not know that. Alright, let's quick save this thing. Considering how much stuff I had to do to it since I saved it back or loaded back in. Alright. going on Not yet. I don't feel like that view does it really justice. undercarriage I really need to do some landscaping here Jesus Christ Man, this thing sure knows how to... Oh my god. Garage. Get to bed. I 
it got some angle on it. Maybe on a future episode I can get this thing stuck in the grass one more time. Now maybe we can go to the racetrack. Like where I took the Trans Am. That's uh that's gonna be it for this one. But this is don't know if this is gonna work or not, so let's try this real fast. Would you pick that son of a bitch up? Alright. This game is pissing me off. All right, there we go. Toad cup sign. Yep. Looks pretty sweet. Let's see if we can't get it a little closer. couple of them up here but yeah so i think i'm gonna end that one here um hope y'all enjoyed something a little different but uh yeah so uh this i, I believe this is gonna be my next episode um not sure what i'm gonna do with it uh we're just gonna build it up a little bit maybe Maybe go race it or do something. I don't know. It'd be cool to do like a junkyard run. I think that'd be pretty fun. Uh, so, yeah. And then I'll just get this one in a future one, too. We'll build the motor and get it lowered down and all that good stuff and get it probably put up there as well. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to end up selling this one and the Chevelle. But we'll take both of these to the service center and sell them, see what we can get out of them. I think that'd be pretty fun. And, you know, just free up some room. And then the shop truck, well, it just, you know, do whatever. We'll just keep circle, you know, circulating cars and building them, selling them, that kind of stuff. But, yeah, so... Let's see if I can't get a good... Yeah, it's not bad. 
There we go. All right. Well, I want to thank all y'all for watching and um, stay tuned for the next ones. So thank you.